as children were animated by language. Meaning that you're supposed to love this grunt. You're supposed to hate that grunt. This grunt, that grunt. Uh, uh, uh. But there's like 6,000 different languages on earth. You know, with G-timers, we're class in 10. So that we can find the reserve words, meaning the words that map to objects of earth time or man time, you know, out of the top 10. That's what we do at G Timers of the Tech Age. But, you know, I've done enough of that. I don't want to talk about business. I'm talking about like how I process word and the word telepathy, tele telepathic. You know, that word is kind of like um, intuitive. Or how a mother and a baby communicate. You know, it's the connotation detonation of how that the, you know, because all, I mean, once you think above language, you're able to see how the language evolved all by yourself. No one has to tell you. You go, oh, they were mapping to this grunt and this phenomena and that word spawned. Telepathy or telepathic and let me tell you how it is is that is that do you see this tree right here here at the office of the American dream this tree during the hot summers in California is like the uh, a, a, a awning but a living awning to the whole house and do you see it coming back right now let's see if we can you know look at all the see how the little flowers and stuff are coming back it's spawning right now and it's coming back well i always feel stronger when this tree is in bloom and when it has leaves and when it, it's like an antenna and we're talking about i don't know te, when i say the word tele telepathy i do not mean some you know, programmed my man timed grunt. I'm talking about, you know, a phenomena, a word that maps to objects that when somebody calls, you are sometimes like maybe once or twice a week, easy. Somebody calls you and you know who it is before you pick up the phone. All right? And, and, and that, and that, and that connection to the one, you know, um, native citizen life that's on this earth when we're actually, you know, that instead of being human before animal, we're animal, meaning that we're one with the earth before we're human. And that is where the kids get all their natural rights and that the life of earth evolves. All right, above us. Because we don't know nothing. I mean, it's like I always say, ignorance is our strength. Now back to the what I'm talking about. Is that, you know, this plant, I feel the life in it. I just feel it and it's coming back. And when you look around here, I mean, there's really, I don't think there's a place on earth that has more life per square mile than where I live. I don't know how I ended up here. Hell, it could have been that there was a signal set out and they go, Johnny, solve the child adult logic dichotomy from here. We've been setting you up your whole life. You live for a blink of an eye, and you are our tool. We are one with the world. I love you, friends, and bye-bye. It's been an honor sharing this with you.